Joel got. He got got once. He got got. I don't know. You got it. A hundred times. One hundred times. Sounds so low in mine. Really? Yeah. It sounds really fucking good in mine. Does it? Yeah, really crisp. It's crispy. It's crunchy. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. How's that? Yeah. Oh, it sounds real oh, good yeah. now. Oh, yeah. Uh, good. Dude, we're in it. We're in it. All right, we got so many fucking things. Hello. Okay, you ready? Hey! Hey! Welcome back to another episode of the Dick and Booties podcast. I'm Dick. I'm Booney. Wow! It's been a long. Missed you, dog. Missed you. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's been it For has real. one whole month. Fuck, dude. Longer than a month. Has a, it been longer than a month? A month. Yeah, like uh, almost a month and a maybe a month and a week or something. Five weeks. God damn, we talked tenderloins and then. <sighs> Everything happened. <laughs> I know, dude. Because you uh, had tenderloins for Christmas. Yep. That's dope. How'd they, it go? Oh, <laughs> just like you fucking said it would. Did it go good? Veggies. Fucking. <sighs> oh, dude. How'd you fucking Perf- sear it in that pan? It was. A, I did. Yeah. It, did, it was a little crowded. It was a little crowded. But. You handled it. I got that sear. You know, nice. luckily, you know, my folks have the fan. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> you know? The unit. Which was huge. Because, yeah. you know, I just had these fuckers in there just. <laughs> Real getting seared off. The ceiling unit. Yeah. The fa- um. Mm-hmm. What do they call that? A fucking exhaust fan. That's it. Or a fart fan. A fart fan. Yep. Is that where you go to fart? That is where you do your fart. That's where you do your fart. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude. They went off like so good. I'm so glad I called you. Just like every fucking time I do. I'm always glad I did. What veggies because, did you use? Uh, les onions. Okay, sorry to T- cut you. Yeah. Taters. Yes. Um, mm. asparagus. Ah. Yeah, dude, they, they they handled all right. So good. Yeah, yeah, they handled all right. Um, <laughs> what did I do? Onions, Brussels, potatoes. I did Brussels, yeah! Brussels, as aspigies, aspigies. Yeah, and I think that's it. That's yeah. all you need. Yeah, yeah, the po- four. You did potatoes, potatoes, onion. What kind of as- potatoes? Red potatoes. Red potatoes. Is that good? So good. Yeah, that's- I feel like I buy those more than I buy the others. They're waxy. That's, oh, that's a waxy tater, mm. and it's good. No, yeah. it's a it's a good roasting tater. A good roasting because it's got the resilience. Mm, resilience. Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't do. I wouldn't rice those. You know what I mean? I wouldn't put right. that in a potatoes rice. And like I, we were talking about the fucking mashed that one dude, time. Oh, dude, you I, know. Fuck, <laughs> I was like, damn, dude. Turns to gum. Yeah, <laughs> turns to gum. Oh yeah. Uh, what do you? What would you use? I mean. Those Yukon Golds or those Russets? Ah, uh, dude, I use the Russets. I use the Ukes. The Ukes. I like to use the Ukes. <laughs> All right, yeah. Look, they're, dude, they're, word is bond. Dude, they're like <laughs> just a hair waxy. Okay. You know what I mean? But yeah. Russets. <laughs> Russets. Idaho's. I mean. Both really good riced potatoes. Uh, and, I mean, if you're going to do a twice bake, you got to go russet. Oh. You can't yeah. go any other one. Can't go any other because one. Because they're big. They're big. Oh, I lo- <laughs> and, dude, when because twice bakes are so... It's a they're, meal. It's a meal in itself. I yeah. love when you get a big one, dude. Like a real big one. Yeah. And that, dude, because you put all the stuffing in into the mixture. Yeah. And so then it's a really nice convex. Mound. Yeah. Con- convex. Yeah. And then, dude, you fucking... Bro- you just fucking... Dude, cook them real quick and then broits. Yeah. And then right when that cheese is a little bubbly. Pull them out. Yep. You're done. God, and and you it, can just eat one of those. You're set. You you really are good. Yeah. Now, do I do that? Who does that? No, it does no, that. Yeah, they're I'm, always I'm, a side. <laughs> dude, I'm having seven slices of fucking tri tip. <laughs> yeah, 100%. And asparagus. Yep. Just to, you know. Just You're to, such an asparagus guy. I am such an asparagus guy, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. I really am. It's we are too because there's four veggies we make in our house so far okay. because like the kids are into it. Kids are into it. Corn. You know what? Corn <gasps> is a is a fifth that I do sometimes few and far between. Wow. 
Yeah. I'm surprised because Ruby's at the age where corn on the cob's got They it. love it. It's dope shit. No, Ruby loves corn <laughs> on the cob. <laughs> uh, Cash <laughs> just fucking ch- goes after it. Yeah, he yeah, just he eats the cob. Crushes it. <laughs> eats the cob. Yeah. It's just, <laughs> you know, <I> go, <laughs> just sucking yeah, on the cob. Dude, yeah, dude. Just sucking on cobs. And then I'll put a couple of them in their lunch for the next day because, like, sometimes oh. a nice little cold. Cob, cob, cooked cold cob, dude. A cooked is, cold cob, dude, is legit, dude. <laughs> I'd do that. I'd do it. But no, the fo- the top four are broccolis, mm-hmm. aspies, mm-hmm. green beans, of course, Excuse and me. Brussels. Brussels. Yep. Cauliflower's in there. <sighs> It'll make its way. It will, and I want to know. I want to. I could look up whatever because I want to make a good. Because do you ever cut them into steaks and grill them? Cause that's the shit, right? Yeah. Do you ever put like a sesame? Yeah. 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 But so here's the thing about sesame, dude. It's, Always when high heat is involved, it's one of those things where you can baste while you're cooking with everything other than the sesame oil part. Got it. That is the very end for the final baste. Oh, just the final basting. Cause just if to get you, the flav at the end, dude, if you fucking throw that on, like, <sighs> yeah, you, th- those are the times where like, I'll walk into like a party with all my friends and like one guy's like entire, uh, like grill is on fire and he's <laughs> screaming. I'm like, eh, what kind of oil do you use? <laughs> what kind of oil? Yeah. Probably real low smoke point over there. Yeah. I was using the sesame. No, dude. <laughs> no, dude. you can't use sesame hundred percent of the time on the grill. I am cannolis yep. and veg. Yeah. Pure. That's it. They can I, handle it. Because I have I have I have fa- fallen victim many times to extra virgin olive oils. Oh yeah. And that fucks me up because when uh, when oil catches flame yeah. around a veggie, first mm-hmm. of all, it turns into soot. Right. You ever notice yeah. that? And yep. then it tastes like shit. It's sooty. It's fucking ruined. <laughs> yeah. You really, really literally you riddle, 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 have to get a rag and you got to fucking get it off of there. Yeah. Or you got to rinse it and then start over. But your tri-tip marinade is olive. Right. It's but there's stuff in there cutting it. Mine's not. Oh, you use the veggies? So I'll throw just like to pour one out for my homies. Got it. I'll throw one little of oh. olive oils. I'm 100% veg. I do that for. I gotta be honest with you. <laughs> I fucking squatched a tri tip <laughs> last week, and I was bitter, son. <laughs> but like, I, I, cause I went in my marinade full all eve. Yeah, dude. Yeah. It'll trouble you every time, dude. It did. And dude, I gotta I, be I, honest. With you. I fucking I scorched. Well, so the, <laughs> yeah, I mean, it was black sooty bark city, <laughs> ah, and so but, I was like, well, this is fucked. So literally, you know, we like to eat six six thirty. Yeah, you guys are fucking. I ran to sprouts. It. Yep. I grabbed a couple of sirloin fillets, pan. Did saved the day. Saved the day. But I also took my <laughs> poor fucking dry tip and I threw it in the oven. To just oh. get it the middle good, dude. I fucked up. You know? I fucked up a tri tip before. I know. I, not on the grill. I I tried this like, I don't want to say it's like a braised recipe. It was kind of. It was a braised recipe. Okay. And it was a recipe that someone I knew from like three jobs ago had told me about, and she, and she made it and it was delicious. And I was like, oh, let me try this, dude. I did not put enough <laughs> liquid in that pan. Oh, it just fucking. <laughs> when I opened it up. Because it, it, it was like a lot of red wine, there was it was just black. It was black all the way up to the like almost to the halfway point of the lid, and the little the little meats had gone down into little meat pucks. And I was like, "What the fuck?" I was like, "I have <laughs> never done this before." They were like little tiny little triangles, and I was just like, "Oh!" I go, "They have lost seventy percent of their weight, yeah, dude." <laughs> dude, I, it's I, like chewing into a fucking. Tire, <laughs> dude. I, I, I cut into it, and you know, how there's like a little bark. Nah, this was all bark. So it was, just, it was like cutting into a briquette. You know, I was nice. just like, it's like, and that is all I had for dinner planned. Oh. I don't know. I think we had Fruit Loops. No contingency. I think, oh, fr- Fruit Loops. I think, we had, I think we had Fruit Loops. This is when I was living all on my own. I had all three kids. Charlie wasn't even two yet. Yeah, and I was just like a wreck. You know what I mean? Like just yeah. having to be like, ah, 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 you know, just right. like all the time worried about 
three kids and I'm all by myself and just like I want to be totally self sufficient, not ask for any help. Yeah. We had Fruit Loops. We had Loops that you night. You were trying a new thing. Trying a new thing. And big mistake. <laughs> you're human. I am human. Gosh, believe it or not. I've had, dude, that's the thing though, bro. You got to fuck up every once I in a while. I always fuck up. No, dude, you don't. I swear to God, dude, not all the time, <laughs> but like, but I fucked up enough to where now I don't have to fuck up a lot. Yeah. Right? So it's, it's one Learning. of those, it is so when I worked at North, we, yeah. we, one of the salads had a uh, crispy prosciutto mm -hmm. over the top. A little yeah. crispy prosciutto. Yeah. And, you know, they had a fat log of prosciutto. Yeah. No, I'm sorry. Prosciutto McGavin. I'm sorry. <laughs> Penchettes. Oh, that's different. <laughs> <laughs> Lardons. Come on, it was Lardons. <laughs> it was the Lardons. So we stick that bitch in the freezer, get that fucking log of panchettes nice and cold, and then you can go over to the slicer. Yeah. Because there's so much fat in it. If you take it to the slicer, that bitch is getting fucking... Oh, yeah. You got to have it frozen almost. Got to have it almost froze. Brazils. So, we, so I'm doing that. I had like six sheet pans... Of like all the discs and just to throw it in the oven just to get them crispy to, yeah. to throw on the salad. <laughs> well, I got started on the beats. <laughs> I got me, distracted. I'll tell you what I was. I was I was uh, I, I, I was peeling beets <laughs> and I was trying to meet requirements. I had, I had a certain vinegar uh, sugar ratio. Yeah, I, I really dialed in because I was new there. I was also straight on H bomb. <laughs> yeah, right. That's the other thing. <laughs> like I wasn't totally You might right. forget about the pan sheets. I might have been I might have had my I might have fallen face first into the beats, forgot about the sheets. <laughs> prosciutto. Um uh, pan I was going to say like crispy prosciutto is like beef jerky. Yeah. <laughs> or but, not. You know what? Ooh, you know what would be really good? What? Oh, Cuz it just reminded me of this gas station <laughs> off they're all gas station. Yeah. Right. So the best ones. But this one, dude. Oh my God. What was if I it? dropped it on the ground, yeah. it would have went into one million pieces. Oh, it was it, it, it was, was glass. Yeah, dude. Just Aye. like it was the worst beef <laughs> turkey, dude. And That's you're not bummed. You out of your your, and you're bummed because you definitely just spent fucking twelve bucks oh, yeah, on least. a little bullshit one. Dude, what is dude, what happened to beef jerky prices? I don't know, dude, but I was like it was like this airy light piece of shit that it was just like, yeah, a sheet of glass. It, it was it was it like one of those roadside like some, local joints. Oh wow, they fucked up. They fucked it up. They just or too thin. I didn't check the fucking date. Oh yeah, I did. It was good. I checked the yeah, date. Dude. It was good. I checked the date. He just cut this is this is your style of. Mm -mm. Here's the thing, dude. I believe that he knew or she knew they fucked it up. Yeah. But what are they going to do? Put it out. They got to put it out. Yeah. Let's see who buys it and just cam. <laughs> yeah. Got my 12 bucks. Here's my money. Just and I'm just driving home from Tucson. Like, <laughs> they're just like, they're like, wait, before you go, one gallon of apple cider. <laughs> yeah. And you're like, of course. Of course. Yeah. Which dude. luckily probably saved it. <laughs> Here's the thing. You can always go for that. Dude, the one I want to make beef jerky. You should. You gotta get a. You gotta get a Ronco food dehydrator. Is that the brand? <laughs> you know Ronco? No. Come on. What? I think it's Ronco. God, what's his fucking? He he had infomercials for fucking years. His main jam was the Ronco food food dehydrator. Oh okay. yeah. Main jam, dude. We're talking banana chips. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is it the guy that I sent you a picture of? Where he looked like a fucking midget devil. <laughs> no, I think. And that... you were like, dude, I've seen this guy a billion times, and I laugh at him every time. <laughs> no, I think he's got the gray, and he's like, and his crazy eyebrows. No, that's the dude. That's the juicer guy. That's the juice man. Okay. Juicer. <laughs> that's fucking Jim Carrey, dude. Yes. That's <laughs> fucking fire marshal so Bill. <laughs> good, dude. He's dude. He's doing the juicer. Infomercial, dude. This shit's fucking amazing. Dude. Wait, was it the was it the guy that you sent me? Was he a big fat guy with a beard and it kind of like had like uh, receding hair? No. Okay, because that's the OxyClean guy who did a lot of cocaine and he <laughs> yeah. died, I think, of a cocaine over. Yeah, he was amped, bro. Dude, he was jacked up. <laughs> yeah. He's like, you spray a little bit on the fucking <laughs> dude, right dude. on the tub. One, one spray, and you're just like, holy shit, holy dude. Shit, dude. And you find out he died of cocaine. You're like, yeah. Yeah. 
what else would he have died from? <laughs> Cocaine. Cocaine. It might, it's probably that, dude. It was yeah. probably what you said. I can't remember in my brain what you sent me, but Ronco food dehydrator. Okay. Dude, we're talking banana chips. Okay. We're, we're talking beef jerks, and I don't know what else. How disappointing is a not sweet banana chip? Oh, not good at all. Dude. Yeah, you know when you buy them, you're like, oh, I'm childhood, man, fuck yeah. You eat one, you're like... Pfft. It tastes like air. Yeah. It tastes just, like... Come on. Like one, like one of those things you put under like a table to make it fit right. <laughs> a, ch- a shim? Yeah, a shim. Or but a, like... A shiv. No. It's a shim. Yep. <laughs> what if what if the only thing you used in your house was just banana chip shims? <laughs> it's actually shims. not a bad idea. <laughs> They'll hold, dude. And they'll they might, hold. They might have a little, you know what I mean? A little a little yeah, slide a little taper. Proof, a little slide proof. Oh, too. yeah, yeah, a little traction. Maybe a little traction. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, but yeah, the tendies came out good. Okay, that's nice. That was good. Perfectly cooked. Perfectly cooked. Mm-hmm. <laughs> One thing though. Uh oh, wrangling everyone. Yeah. You know, you want everyone to be seated. Yes. And bring it out. Never. That's happens. hard. Never happens. Never happens. So, you always have that time where it's like, ah, that sat a little longer than I wanted yeah. it to. Yeah. It rested. It rested, rested seven bit. minutes longer than you wanted. Mm-hmm. My dad will just stay outside just just to be just to <laughs> not follow the crowd. I'll be like, it's dinner right. time, and my dad will be like, yeah. And then I'll go back in. Everyone comes back in, and it's just my dad out there. And I'm like, "What you doing out there?" And he's like, "Ah, <laughs> coming in right now." Yeah. And I'm like, "Why did you do that, though?" And he's like, "I don't know." <laughs> you, you call him out. Yes, dude, You're because like, what are you he doing because he likes to be late. Yeah. Even to like the you sections. You can't be the first one. Yeah, but like this, even like the little sections within the party. Yeah. Like the last one to, to the to the um to the cake. He's the last one inside for dinner. He's always the last one. Right. He's always fidgeting with like the speaker. I'm like, <laughs> no. Like it was perfect, but he felt like he had to do something. He had to just twist the, the knob troubles. a little bit, <laughs> or he doesn't because we always have the birthday song lined up. It's like yep. just have that. Ready to go instead of not when we're ready to go. Yeah. You know what I mean? He's like on it at the wrong time. <laughs> so that always happens. Oh, I dude. He likes to be fashionably late. A little he, bit. he does. Yeah. He does. It's kind of his big fucking to do. And I don't understand. I, it's I, it's rude. <laughs> Bottom line. Yeah. <laughs> it's just rude. <laughs> so I don't get how that's a cool, how that became a cool thing. <laughs> we all know that of him. Granted, granted, listen, people. He pays for everything, and we do all the stuff yeah. at his house. I live with the guy, yeah. uh, but it's rude. He can be late for his dinner. He can do he whatever wants. he wants, honestly. Um, dude, let me tell you something real quick. That I think that I just want to get it out there into the world so that people yeah. cannot be such pieces of shit. Ooh. Right. So I am literally done with my job this this evening, and I get a call from my supervisor. I need to go up to inspect this property. Because the the property manager has complained or has gotten complaints from the tenants, right? Okay. So I get there and the property is fucked. Okay. So it's not me inspecting anymore, it's me servicing the property. Oh. Which means at four o'clock I spent two hours picking up garbage. So three of those huge black bags, you know what I mean? Yeah. You'd put grass leaves. in or yeah. whatever. Yeah, maybe leaves. Grass would be too heavy. No, I put grass in the black bags, too. But you don't fill it all the way up to... Th- you can't I just fill it think up if it's top. a commercial, it's going to have leaves. That's right. <laughs> There's leaves on the box. Right. <laughs> so I fill up three of those with just trash all around the perimeter, right? So I'm... I'm dude, I'm butthurt. The sun is going down. Yeah. And I'm picking up trash. Now I have... So I've gotten most of the perimeter. Now I am in the main parking lot and there's just so much trash in the parking lot i'm just like now where does this all really come from because a lot of the stuff like in the back and on the sides like a truck will dump the shit and stuff will fly and it gets into the landscape and i'm like okay i understand that yeah that's just normal that's normal stuff it gets away okay it gets away from them yeah and those fucking guys Fuck them too, dude. They oh. will they will crush anything that's around. They don't <laughs> yeah, give a fuck. Sure, They're yeah. not sweeping. Yeah. They have whatever, dude. I've talked about it many times and I I, I fucking hate them. So <laughs> So I'm out there, dude, and I'm like in the main parking lot, dude. It's like five thirty, so I've been there for like an hour and a half, and I'm thinking to myself, who who, who how does this even really yeah. get here? Blah blah. 
I am 15 feet away from this beat up fucking truck that has one of those camper things on the back. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Just like total fucking serial killer shit. Yeah. And you could tell that it, it maybe had like 65 more miles before it was going to just inevitably die. Yeah. But they're living in it. And just outshoots a fucking half full soda oh. in its fucking cup. Lid on. Lid on. He's just Explodes. Like, he just goes and just throws it out and just goes. And I was like. Dude, me, myself, and Irene shit. Dude, I, my eye, I was like, oh, oh God. Oh. I, I, and then I just sort of like looked at the guy and he looked, he looked like a serial killer. And in fact, here's the thing. Here's, you, I don't think that a serial killer and a guy who does that is really all that different. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like you had, there's a level of like, Non self awareness, yeah, yeah. you have to have for both, yeah. You know what I mean? To go and fucking murder somebody right. and just be like, <laughs> and just walk away <laughs> and just like wipe off your knife and stick it back in your little, you know, yeah. What is that? At least sheath? they're clean about, yeah, yeah. The sheath, the little, the little sheath, yeah. And just to be like, and just to throw out a full a and half. let it explode and feel okay with yourself. I, I was like, dude. I, what I wanted to do was because he didn't really see me and I had like one of those long like picker upper things. Yeah, I, wanted I, was, to, uh, <laughs> I wanted to just be like Fish! and just fucking hit him as hard as I could. Yeah. Just like in the side of his face. Yeah. And just kind of like duck and just be like, he's never going to fucking see me. Yeah. Just be like, whack. And then just like get out because right. that would hurt so bad. First of all, it would hurt really bad. Second of all, I've picked up so much poo poo with that thing. Yeah. So if to- you don't hurt him. In initially, the, in the long run, he'll get the infection, conjuncties, and yeah, dude, he'll get a for pink sure. eye for sure. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna have a swollen a stink uvula. Stink eye. <laughs> he's gonna have a stink <laughs> oh, dude. But I wanted to <laughs> fucking, I, I wanted to pop his tire. I wanted all those things, and I was like, dude, what kind of an animal? I know. Just does that yeah. and has not a care in the world. Just thinks the whole fucking world owes them everything. Just, <laughs> just right out the window. Yeah. And I'm pretty. So what I did do. Is like thirty seconds later, I just like went up to the window and was just like, "Oh, you stared at him while you picked up his cup." I just and he looked at you and he was just like, (laughs) 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 "And I was like, (coughs) makes sense. You are disgusting." Dude, he just looked like he had so much just like snot and saliva and like he his like hair. Dude, it looked like ah, dude. Yeah. I was like, fuck this guy. He's been doing that for years. His whole life. He knows no different. No. He doesn't even know better. He just thinks that's fine. That's what it is. I do get enraged equally when I see people do that too. I'm like, what are you thinking? And and here's the thing, dude. I just happen to catch that guy. I've never seen that. Like, as I'm like droopy dog fucking ooh, just like all bummed out and then just like like right in front of my face so i was like, <laughs> like i was about to lose it when you are were picking up the trash yeah did you portray droopy dog and say first you make a name then you made it in the bag boom boom dee, 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 dee. and then did bears come up and help you what i did is i went i went excuse me you he goes, he goes, bah! I go, excuse me, sir. And he's like, bah! I said, check this out. Whack! And I hit him, and then I was out of there. <laughs> yeah. You hit him in the eye, hit him in the dick. Fuck that guy. Late. I know that pisses me off, too, bro. All right. I wanted to. How dare you? Yeah, fuck that guy. Um, and the thing is, like, so many other people had done that. I just didn't see it. There's a so. I, I think that the ratio is like 80, 20, especially depending on like what region you are, uh, where like people are just like more pieces of shit, the more northwest you go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, uh, who cares? Um, <laughs> so Chris Cheatwood, what's up, homie? He sent this email uh, January 9th. He goes, where has all the laughter and tasty gems been? Oh. Missing the new episodes. Mm. Us so, too, brother. Us too. So, Chris, let's just talk a little bit. So, let's just talk about 
what has happened in the last five weeks? Five weeks of fuckery. Okay, so what was the first week? What Did, was the first week? It was on you, man. Oh, yeah, I had a fucking ear infection, bro. That went to your butthole as well, right? Right. <laughs> Which healed faster than my ears did. Your butthole healed faster. Real quick. Your butthole. Because I willed it. It's like, well, I can handle an ear infection, which are terrible. They are the worst. But if you're going to pick which one's going to fucking heal quicker. Fucking. I fucking willed it so. Okay. So, So yeah, dude. That was the week one, wasn't it? Yeah, you had diarates. Oh, yeah. No, I was puking and shitting. You were puking and shitting. Yeah. And you had the ear infection. Well, no. That was week one. That was week one. Week two. Week two or three was my ear infection. Oh, okay. Week two was, I think, someone else. No, week two was Christmas. Yeah. Right? It was just like Christmas well, time. Just, yeah, Christmas time. Holidays, yeah. It was like, or like New Year's Day or something. Yeah. So you had diarrhea. And, ki- and my kids were sick, too. That's what it was. Yep. That's what it was, yep. too. Right? They were sick through the whole two weeks of holidays. So that was it the was first awesome. two weeks. Yep. Then the third week... That was ear infection week. Yep. And honestly, I was so close to just doing an episode mm-hmm. like on my own. But then I was like, why don't we just wait? <laughs> like, do yeah. we have the whole team? Yeah. You know what I mean? I was like, I, what are, what are we going to do? I don't want like the first time to come back just to be fucking me. You know? Yeah. That's no fun. Let me uh, tell you about that ear infection, though. Yeah, tell me. It was that. fucking weird. Nothing I experienced before. It was a weird infection. So there was like. There was like bleeding in there. Okay. Oh, okay. Like something happened. And then I developed this um I gotta I gotta say the word right. But it's double hearing. So Oh, that sounds awful. It was, dude. And I so like we have the double office on hearing. on TV at night. We go to bed and um it's on in the morning, you know, just whatever, peacock. And um, dude, so the opening song to The Office, I wake up, and it sounds like in one ear, it's it's the normal tune, and in the other ear, it's a fucking four-year-old who doesn't know how to be in key playing the other part. Oh. So it was this weird... So I was like, is this like... I'm trying to think, like, did they do this as like a thing? Like, is this a goofy, like style of this song like why is it different because oh, okay. they've changed the song a f- couple times like just okay. how they play it um but dude so then i'm listening to people talk yeah and it's one <laughs> octave but it's not an octave it's one key here and one key here ew everything i was hearing oh i would... was coming in in different keys how much anxiety did you have i dude? did i, I that did. would that would just be sheer anxiety yeah it, w- no. it was Okay. And it lasted for three diplocusis. 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 Hearing disorder where an individual perceives a single sound as different pitches in two ears. Dude. Most commonly known as double hearing. It can present as a secondary symptom of hearing loss. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, however, it also occurs with those with normal hearing. So I was just all face, head, congested. Wow. Like, day, like days before this happened. And then the pain came in. And then I went to the doctor. I was like, fucking, I have an ear infection. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And he looked in there. He's like, yeah, there's some like hemorrhaging and stuff. And I'm like, whoa, heavy. Dude, didn't you have, um, you had, um, vertigo once? Vertigo. Yeah, that's inner ear. So okay. this particular it's thing is, is middle ear. Oh, it's middle oh, ear. Oh, you didn't know. I didn't know. <laughs> dude, I've had all the ear. I know you have. Of all time. Especially at 30,000 feet. Oh, dude. But, Kill me. Yeah, dude. So, and I thought about you during my whole thing. Aww. I was like, fuck, dude. You're just like it, blood just, shooting out of your ear. You're like, well, oh, it, it wasn't. And well, so I would put a heat, like a hot washcloth that yeah. I microwaved yeah. and laid on it. It gets cold and in then 30 the fuck, seconds. It, it gets, that's why I microwaved it. Because it bitch. gets cold in 40 seconds if you microwave it. It's, it's so annoying, dude. dude. And your pillow is just soaked. And yeah. It's just such a dumb It's the worst way thing. to do it. Yeah, I yeah. know. <laughs> and I didn't know how else. Heat but uh, I'd wake up and there would be like discharge on my pillows, bro. Yeah, brother. And it's just soaked. You know, it's just dripping out. And <sighs> it was a bad scene, dude. So it only was in this ear. And then... 
Came on over. Came on over. How does it come over? Don't know. That canal doesn't connect. No. So you must have you must have gone like this, and then somehow got some of the goo. Maybe I transferred goops. I think you might have. Hundred percent, I did more than tranny once. Goo. Yeah, did you tranny goo? I did. <laughs> but they were like, they're like, did you stick anything foreign in your ears? I'm like, yes, because <laughs> I don't use Q-tips. Right. I use a bobby pin, okay. but I never go deep. I don't like scrape my brain. I just because with a bobby pin, you can yeah feel a little better about oh. not jamming the shit in. But you also itch it a little bit and it kind of scoops out. Some Your little stuff. dingaling. Gets yeah. Going. And Wes taught me that. So good. Wes, Wes posted something once that said use a bobby pin. Nice. So I went with it and ran. So anyway, dude, that was a shitty time. So I had like an ear infection for like a week straight. So that's three weeks. Double then. hearing. Double hearing. When that went away, happy guy. Oh, I'll bet. How I long did like, that last for? Four days. Oh, my God. It was fucking... Dude. It was getting psychotic. Like, I was dude, like, dude, I can't... Are, dude, when Cash is like, Dad, you're like, ah! Yep. It's like, Dad, Dad, Yep. Because they're, they're high-pitched thing already. Yeah. And then it's like... Oh, dude, it was so... Double hearing. Yep. You think that would be like a cool superpower? Yeah, you not would. at all. Mm-mm. Just like, dude, if you could like see like a chameleon, dude. I was thinking about that, dude, and I was like, "Yo, yeah," like just looking at the window and this <laughs> at the same time, and your dick. You're just like, how, <laughs> how do you? <laughs> so I guess their brain can realign and connect and configure, so it's almost like a panoramic. But to me, when when a fucking chameleon's going like this, yeah, dude, I'm going, dude. You gotta be going crazy in yeah, that little that brain, Yeah, anxieties. And fucking like <laughs> shrimps and stuff. Dude, they have like hundreds of eyes per... Shrimps? I think shrimps. They have hundreds? I think per bu- like pu- per uh, bulb. bulb, there's like hundreds of eyes in there. Oh, no shit. Definitely in the mantis shrimp. You know what a mantis shrimp is, right? Mm. Where they got the fucking thing and they go, bam! It goes like this? Yeah, dude. And they fucking hit stuff. And dude. They, that's how they get their prey. Dude, a crab will just be like, just like, I'm a crab. I love being a crab. Crabby, crab, crab. Here I am. And then this fucking mantis will be like, And then he's like, bop. Dude, it's so funny, dude, because the crab's like this. like, And then when it gets hit, it just goes. It starts to like float away because oh, really? it, it gets knocked <laughs> clean out. <laughs> and then when it's just stripped over the crab, it's full armor. Dude, fucking, dude, somehow just... It sucks in the face, sucks probably. Sucks in the face. Yeah. It's, it's a vulnerable spot. It's wild. Whoa. Dude, they, they said it's like the most powerful hit in all of the animal kingdom. It's like Tyson of shrimp. Gnarlier. Something like there's like a some sort of sound wave bubble explosion thing happens. Oh, really? Yeah, and it's just like... Dude, the crab, no chance. Dude, and a fish. Dude, I've seen a fish kind of going by, and it's just like, like waiting, and just goes, bop! And the dude and the fish just goes, and it's like, it's just belly. It like, <laughs> really? Yeah. I can't wait to look this up, dude. It's fucking wild. Mantis shrimp. Yeah, and those eyes are just like, <laughs> and they're just looking all over, and just like, all of that's Beating going in. Beating the shit out of Which is wild, because like, you think about, dude, I, I sometimes I think... Especially about like animals being killed. Yeah. And you think about their level of like intellect and like you know that they have pain receptors. Yeah. And you go, okay, I'm a meat eater. And it's hard sometimes for me to get past the fact that I know some of those animals have like a family. Yeah. And you just murdered their dad. Yeah. How would you like to get eaten by a fucking lion? It would suck. It'd be very bad. Well, yeah. Right. And, and you know what? You're the lion. The animal kingdom is not kind. They don't give a fuck about. No. If you're little, if you got a family, none of that. shit. Right. So dolphins might. <laughs> dolphins. Dolphins might. But dolphins straight fuck up. Dude, yeah. You, great white shark. Yeah. Fuck you. dude. Yeah. Yeah. They do that little. The little beak thing. <laughs> yes. They fu- they get them right in the fucking gills, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah, that's right, dude. Great whites, fucking. <laughs> fuck you, dude. Fucking fuck you, dude. But I I, I feel you, dude. Like, um, yeah. You think about because like if it's if it's got eyes, dude. It's like it's like all computing all this shit. Yeah. And you were just like grab a little manty leg and just be like, 
<laughs> just rip it off. Oh. He would be like, ow! Yeah. That's my leg! Come on! <laughs> Dude. I don't know how I didn't see you. Yeah. <laughs> <Bah>! you get- <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Dude, in the goddamn Netflix thing with the fucking octopus, right? And the octopus, like, he meets the octopus. The octopus and him form a relationship. Have you seen it? No. Whatever, dude. It's this <laughs> octopi fucking documentary. And this guy, he falls in love with an octopus. He fucks it. No, but you think he almost wants to, the way he talks about it. Oh, anyway, yeah. Still, I cried that a lot. I feel pretty wild. I cried a lot. So he, he, he fucking befriended this octopi, right? And he's there, and he's filming it. And then this little shark comes in and, like, rips one of its arms off, oh, dude. Oh, damn. And parts of their brains in their arm. Did you oh, know really? That? I learned a lot about it. There's octopus. just all this fucking shit string coming out i like think it's, it's its brain i think it's like 80 percent of its intellect comes from its tentacle nerves for sure right so and all, it's got like thousands of suckers that are like move yeah. independently it's crazy it's wild brother and then so when you talk about aliens that's fucking alien that's alien oh the deeper you go into the ocean yeah. you might as well be going up to the fucking lantern lane. fish dude fuck Dude, fuck that. How big's a lantern fish? They're like this big, I think. Oh, they are? Yeah, yeah. Oh, they're not like six foot? No, oh, no, no, no. That ain't so bad. But that oarfish shit, doggy. Yeah. Those are like fucking Those 20 are feet. Yeah, fuck, dude. That's alien y. That's Because if you see them in their. It's all rainbowy and yeah. fucking silver surfer. Yeah, I don't like any of that. Yeah, that's I don't want to go down there. First of all, do would you ever? No, no way. Not a chance, right? I don't think so. I First of all, I don't think I could handle it. I don't even like. I would get claustro. Claustro. Yeah, because you're now you're deeper than the sun can shine. Way deeper. And you're like d- down towards the center of the earth. And there's like and some, there's animals down there's there that giants will fuck down you up, dude. And you don't know what they're moving all slow and weird. And if one thing like happens that. to that fucking vessel, you're, you're dead as fuck because the pressure so- is like. That's why I'm not going up to the moon. That's why I'm not going down <laughs> yeah. to the bottom, dude. Good here, terra firma. I'll take the terra firma, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. All day. I don't All even. Day. I don't even really like going up to the mountains. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. But that drive home. Brutes. Oh yeah, I can, yeah. It, well, my, you just think of the worst. Well, it's my case ear. In, oh yeah, you get it. It's my ear. Yeah. Might as well have a fucking earwig. Knife. Yes, it's the An fucking earwig. <laughs> you know those goddamn things. Oh yeah. Hey. Uh, what the fuck was that? Oh. We had another email. Oh, yeah. Should we read it? Yes. Hey, guys, it's me, Mark. Good old Mock. He is, he's such a lovely, I love him, dude. Mark's the real deal. He's the real deal. (laughs) He's the real deal. He's a real deal. Hey, guys, it's me, Mark. This is how I think he talks. Hey, guys, it's me, Mark. No. You think uh, so? No, not at all. Oh, man. Um, you know your number one fan? Yeah, that guy from Canada, eh? Just wanted to say <laughs> Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. This has been a crazy, twisted-up year for me and pretty much the entire world. Yet one of the best things I can do to make it through make it through it is all... You get the face ID. Would you get a new phone? Dude, what? Get back to it. It turned off. Oh, it turned off? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, before we before we finish that, let's 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 finish what we were originally. <laughs> we'll get right back to this, Mark. Mark, we're gonna get right back to it. Dude, don't worry. We're gonna get right back. Oh, we're killing him. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I read? Um Week one, you had the the shits. Yep. Week two. Holidays. Week three. And kids are sick. You yeah. had um, ear infection. Ear infection. Week four. What happened there? I thought I had COVID nineteen. Yeah, you did. The old variant. I think you did, dude. I think I definitely did. You had all the symptoms. Every single symptom <laughs> on the charts. Yep. Except for I, I didn't have I didn't have the breathing issue. Although Omicron. Omicron, uh, Omicron, Omicron, which I, if there's not a band called Omicron, like right now, we should fight. We should do it. We should start it and just be all electro. Oh yeah. And we'll infect people with their, with their ears. <laughs> we will infect their ear pussies. Yeah. We'll infect their ear pussies. Okay. I like it. And it'll just be like, Omicron. <laughs> <laughs> that would be the best fucking song. Omicron. This song is in. Appropriately entitled. This next song is called Omnicron. <laughs> Omnicron. 
So I thought I had Omnicron. And, right. And you had um, been around people that... Yeah. Had had it. Ben had it. Yeah. Um, my girlfriend's father had it. Her cousin had it. Um, several people, like, within uh, this area had it. Yes. Um, and so I thought I had it. And I certainly wasn't going to... Taylor had his big Michael Yo. Yeah, dude. Thing, which... Um, I was looking forward to hearing about. Yeah. So, so anyways, I thought I had it, right? And so we didn't do it again. Can you yeah. believe it? And then today at 745, we get a fucking text from Taylor saying he's got COVID. Yep. So everyone get COVID. Everyone's getting the Omnicron. Give on the cron. <laughs> <laughs> So it's like, it's been tough, Pips. We've been trying to do it. Just one thing after another, Just man. Just one thing after it's another. It's been a tough five weeks. But we're doing it, and we did it. Yeah. And we got to turn this over in one day, and um, which means I'll probably just make like a little a little pictorial, and just we're just going to put it out. Put it out for the peeps. Yeah. Get about 30 views, and hey. It'd be like that beef jerk, dude. Just yeah. put it out. Dude, just put it out. It's like, it's we got it. Sooty. We got to put it out. <laughs> You want to read it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Here you go, but Mark. Yeah, that's been tough, dude. It's been a tough couple of months. It's been a crazy twisted up year for me and pretty much the entire world, yet one of the best things I can do to make it through is all, it all is to put an episode of your pod, put on an episode of your podcast. I see where you went. There. It never disappoints and I'm always pissing me jeans several times throughout the episode. Pissing me jeans throughout pissing the episode. Pissing me jeans. Pissing me jeans throughout the episode. Guys. Guys, last month I promised you a Christmas gift from the north, and I do not want to fail in my delivery. But it looks like you'll have to wait, as sometimes I'm a straight up lazy piece of shit. Hey, uh, hey and, l- let's address that. We were also supposed to ship you something. Yes. We also can sometimes be pieces of lazy shit, lazy pieces of shit, and we didn't send it. So uh, we're the same. I don't even know what we would send. <laughs> we'll send something. All right. But you'll have to wait as sometimes I'm straight up lazy piece of shit. And also I was reminded by my better half that I'm still to do so. Huh? Yep. I get it. We got. Oh, he still yep, has, he to, still do has so. to do so. Oh, so shout out to Mark's fucking wife, dude. Yeah, dude. We don't know her name. Becky. She's what do you think? T- Caitlin. Yeah. Becky. Actually, I think. Becky and Mark. Yeah. Mark and Becky. Mecky. Bark. Bark. <laughs> That's it. That's their Brangelina. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> it's always a bark. <laughs> yeah, it's always up. We bark. Yeah, we bark. <laughs> they go to parties. <laughs> they got a bottle of wine. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, oh, box here. <laughs> box here. Because <laughs> they go to Boston just all the time. Yeah, dude. What up, bark? What up, bark? <laughs> uh, I will be... It will be a late arrival, but it will get there. Oh, cool. Was thinking you guys like the candy taste test thing. Maybe a Canadian version. Yeah. Send us some Smarties, some Coffee Crisp, and... I don't... It's... Kinder Eggs, the real ones. Are Smarties a Canadian thing? Yeah. Oh, you know the origins of candies? Well, some. What about Canadian. Lucas? <laughs> Where's it Doubt it. <laughs> no, they don't get that up north. I'll just say it. What? That's Mexican. Yeah. <laughs> Wrong hole, foo. <laughs> <laughs> it will be a little to get the candy taste test, maybe a Canadian version. That would be so fun. That would. I would Do gladly. that, Mark. Do that, yeah. Mark. Wish I could send some dope craft beer from Muskoka, uh-huh. but the U.S. Canadian borders are dog shit. Dang, dog. True that. Thanks for the best podcast I've found this year. I'm kind of getting sick of JRE and all those like-minded shows. Thanks, oh, man. That's, that's awesome. Like, that's like the nicest that thing That feels ever. really good. People need new wow. stuff. People need the D and B. Yes, the dick and butthole. <laughs> please, don't, please don't stop making content, dudes. Love it. I could sit here and write all the highlights that made me awkwardly spray my goot. Gotchies, <laughs> but that could take hours. Dang, dude. Gotchies. I don't know. This is some Canadian. Yeah, what are yeah. gotchies, eh? Dude, gotchies. <laughs> so so here's to the Dick and Booties podcast. Let's make it through another motherfucking cock sucking clit 
flicken. Flere flør. Ja, klipflikken. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Mark. Cheers, Cheers Mark. Cheers, brother. That's awesome. This one's for you, homie. Yeah. And yeah, we thank, here, here. Yeah, we thank That's you. That's fucking awesome. We, we, we really do thank you for continuously <laughs> watching the program and uh, participating. Mm-hmm. The program, eh? I love the program, eh? Let's have a Donnybrook. Dude, let's have some Tommy Hodgkins. What's that coffee? <laughs> With the coffee? Canadian coffee? Yeah, he, he, he referenced it in another Tommy year. Hodgkins? Dude, Tommy Hodgkins, or is that lymphoma? <laughs> I smoked weed with Tommy Hodgkins. <laughs> so, Thanks, Mac. Cheers, Mac. <laughs> <laughs> well, That's I, awesome, dude. Dude, Bob Saget, bro. Oh. Bobby I know. Sagai. That's such out of left field, dude. I, I, I feel, but every everyone is. Well, I, not everyone, but that one was kind of left field. What Bob, the fuck? Bob Sag is a is like a young, a young sixty five. Yeah, or however yeah. old he was. He looked good. He looked great. I've seen him on several podcasts. Like every time I've ever seen him recently, he's like, and do we know yet? No. So they said I read another, somebody could take weeks. Right. And and here's the other thing. We know Bob doesn't do drugs. He doesn't even do alky halls all that much. He like right. goes and does his shows and then he comes back and he and he takes care of himself and he's good to himself on the road. He doesn't he's Bob Saget. First of all, he's got a bajillion dollars, I'm sure. Yeah. And but you know, we're not close to him. No. But <laughs> there was no public red flags. No. Like he's the cleanest. He's None. Danny fucking Tanner, bro. Dude, he's Danny Tanner. Eh? <sighs> See, here's the thing. Here's one person who did not deserve that was Bob Danny Saget. Tanner, Bob Saget. Danny Tanner, Bob Saget. That's why I'm thinking it's probably like an aneurysm or something dude. fucking stupid and out of the blue. God, dude, I fucking hate the fact that stuff like that exists. Can just happen. Aneurysms? Okay. Though, like, that's... That's what keeps me up at night. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Right. Yeah. Like, yeah that yeah. is truly what keeps me up at night. Yeah. Like, I feel like, okay, if I get, dude, if I get cants, I, I'm just, dude, I'm going to fucking float on out, bro. I'm going to float. Oh, you'll fight. Dude, I'm going to flight and float. <laughs> I'm going to fight. If I'm going to fight, if I'm going to float, I mean, if I'm going to flight, I mean, if I'm going to fight, <laughs> yeah. I'm going to float while I do it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be high. Yeah. So it's like, you get to be high. You, you get to, yeah, you get to, you get to f- do things on your own terms. And, and like, maybe I'll fucking, more or less. dude, maybe I'll go skydiving, which I would never do, bungee jumping, which I would never do, right. maybe whitewater. Deep sea fucking excursions, <laughs> excursions, which I'm sure are super easy and cheap to get on. Make a wish, call James Cameron, have him take you down one of his fucking robotics. That'd be dead. Yeah, submersibles. But like, <laughs> submersibles. <laughs> And but, go see the lantern fish and just be like the last thing you like animal you see before you're just like yeah. whoa. I'm just like, whoa! <laughs> just like, yeah. All right, whoa. all right, take me back up. Let's go up. <laughs> um and then like the pressure kills me. Um so they just let you out. Yeah. But that couldn't be a thing. <laughs> they somehow isolate me in a, in another yeah. chamber and they just open yeah. me up and I'm just like explode. And you just dude. Dude, a fucking dude. They open the door and it's just a mantis strip, just like <laughs> And I freeze. And I fucking float. (laughs) His belly up. That's death by mantis shrimp, bro. (laughs) I wonder if anyone's died of a mantis shrimp. Get in the boo box with fucking (laughs) fifty mantis mantis shrimp. shrimp. I bet they beat the shit out of you, dude. If they got you in the temple in the right spot, (laughs) dude, it would knock you out, right, dude? Dude, for sure. And And for some reason, they know where that spot is. Oh yeah, <laughs> you know they're dialed. Do they know? <laughs> but like, yeah, dude, that's the thing that keeps me up at night. Right, is knowing that brain aneurysms Happen. are a thing. Yeah, and it's like, I don't, I don't think that there is any tail, tall, tall tail signs. Tall tail signs. Tell tale. Tell tale. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Damn it. If they were tall tail signs, you wouldn't believe them because they're tall tail. <laughs> Damn it. If there's anyone who's had 900 tall tale signs <laughs> of something wrong with them, it's you for sure. My hypochondriac. You are it, dude. Yeah. There's Richard telling his tall tale signs. Again. 
I was like, I swear to God, my pinky toe was loose on the other day. <laughs> yeah. I think I got a brain aneurysm <laughs> in my tootsie. Um, but that, yeah. So it, 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 heart attack, right? Yeah. Because he, he did have a bit of a belly and men hold a lot of their like fat and shit like around the heart. Right. That's why we yeah. die of heart disease a lot. Like yeah. women hold it in their fat eyes. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> so it's like we hold it here yeah. and they hold it there. And so I think because I saw him do a, um, you know, Kevin Nealon. Yeah. You love Kevin Nealon, right? Yep. Isn't he the greatest? He's fucking awesome. He's dude. so good. Yeah. So he does a thing where he like hikes and he does like a podcast thing. It's a filmed like it's a it's a video podcast. It's like called like hiking with Nealon or some shit. And they just like go through the Hollywood Hills and he takes he's taken like all the biggest yeah, because he knows everybody, right? Yeah. He obviously knows everybody in the Adam Sandler realm. Yeah, the Happy Madisons, all that shit. So yeah. it's all of them. I think even Adam Sandler did one with him. But he's like they're hiking, and like the one with Bob Saget, you could tell he was getting a little flush. Oh, and he was yeah. a little out of Struggling breath a little bit. And he and that was where I was like, oh, he's got a little bit of a belly because he's he wasn't like he wasn't like fat. But he also wasn't like tip top. He wasn't Danny Tanner skinny. He's 65 or yeah. whatever. You I know? think he had normal weight gain when your metabolism goes out the fucking window. So I'm wondering if he just had a genetic disposition for heart attack or heart Maybe. failure. And if I it, feel like we would know about it now, though. I don't know. Oh, you know, you probably are right. Like if it was but something like, like that. Or like, like even an aneurysm, right? I would think. How do they not know? I know. Should we look it up? Have yeah. you looked it up today? Not today. All right, no, I think I looked it up two day, like a couple days ago. Yeah. Siri. Oh, Siri. Is that how you I'm normally Siri. risk? Shut up, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> hey, how did Danny Tanner die? Here's what I found. Danny Tanner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, dude, I have a fat pimpy right here, Ooh. and I just scratched it. Ow. But it hasn't surfed, or it has surfaced. It's kind of surfaced. Okay. Wow. Okay. Special offer. Dude, I don't want it. <laughs> it won't let me out of it. It won't let me out of it. Look, oh, look, I can't even see? look at that. See, that can't get out of it. It's because you called her a bitch, bro. Uh, I shouldn't She do sent that. you to the fucking cookies. Dude, god damn it. Subscribe now. Never. Back to this one. Is that what it is? New York Times. Okay. I feel like Siri should just answer. Yeah, I know. Shouldn't she? Yeah. Okay. Da, 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 With da, that 5G da. launching tomorrow. I don't even know what you're saying, dude. I think it's the thing. Siri, bitch. Oh, my God. You're not. I won't respond to that. See? She pissed. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. Hey, how did Bob Saget die? God damn it. I'm Siri. I didn't get that. Oh, yeah, you did. <laughs> Hey, how did uh, Bob Saget die? Please. I found this on the web. Okay, here we go. New details. ABC 7. Bob Saget autopsy performed as new report details circumstances of how comedian. Dude, did I read that wrong? Did you ever sometimes like get to an article and you're like, dude, Habib is fucking wrote this for sure? Like our fucking instructions when we <laughs> yeah, pulled our nose hairs out? Turn that microwave on. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Comedian and act actor Bob Saget was found dead lying face up on his bed in a luxury hotel room in Florida with no signs of trauma, according to sheriffs. Also, I see for a short report. They said, <laughs> they said it was orderly. They said the scene was orderly. No yeah. sign of foul play. Yeah. At this time, there's no evidence of drug use or foul play. Okay, the official cause and manner of death are still pending, and yeah. the full investigation and autopsy report could take 10 to 12 weeks to complete. Saget's left arm was across his chest, and his right arm was resting on his bed when deputies and paramedics arrived. So I'm wondering, okay, Whoa. his left arm across his chest, so maybe he what was holding his right arm. Well, your left arm is the one that goes numb and hurts. Okay, so maybe he was trying to make it feel... It's, it's a heart attack. Don't you think? I think so. Probably. 
God, so sad. He did, he wouldn't have. He was. I heard from so many comedians that he was one of the most genuine supportive of like comedians that were coming up like he would do people's podcasts he would take people on the road he would like get people dinner and and sometimes like get them hotel rooms and stuff and he was just one of the sweetest most genuinely amazing comedians he was like, like a comedian dad like yes. dude i'm going to help you out and his jokes dude is so funny cuz his jokes are such like straight 80s 90s style jokes yeah with the bob saget twist of like being very vulgar vulgar yeah and like sometimes just a little over the top you know and you're like you're like wow that's a little that's an extra but which is cool because you want that and when he right the very first time when he was just like you ever suck dick for coke? Yeah. And you're like, holy When we first saw that, we were like, oh my God. That was the best. Because because before I, that, it was full house. It was all full house. And here's <laughs> the thing, dude. Like he, I, I, Supposedly, his comedy had always been vulgar like that. So like people in the industry, it didn't surprise. But this was well before the internet. Yeah, we were 16 yeah. when that came out. So it's like there was... And, right. There was no, we had nothing to go on. Yeah. We had no clue that this is how he fucking <laughs> acted. It blew a lot of people's minds that our age. That was in Half Baked, right? Yeah. Okay, so, and then, dude, and then the Dumb and Dumber -er scene. I've never seen that movie. Oh my God. It's the second, it's my second favorite. So it's obviously, have you ever sucked dick for Coke? That That's number one. Is as it far the as fart all over these walls, Ray thing? <laughs> well, that's from scary movie or whatever oh yeah whatever though i'm a shit all over these walls ray <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> no but he's like he's like there's shit everywhere he's like there's shit on the wall and he's like it's the it's really good um i gotta see yeah you just gotta the see movie. you just gotta well do i not not the movie just find the hi highlights just find the bob saget dumber <laughs> dumber it's when the, it's like the kids who do it it's not the yeah it's not the second one with jim and and Jeff uh, Bridget, uh, <laughs> Jeff Bridges. <laughs> How good would that could be? Could he do it? He could do it. He could, do he it. could be Harry. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Whoa. Not bad. <laughs> that would be Maybe awesome. he even read for the part. Who knows? <laughs> but if they just switch, <laughs> uh, for, for they CGI <laughs> fucking Jeff Bridges for a minute, <laughs> or just half of him there, <laughs> see if anyone notices. Yeah, dude. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, let's uh, um, pour one out for, for old Bob Sagile, huh? <laughs> we love you, man. It's a shame. Everywhere you Waste. look, everywhere is a heart. There's a heart. There's a hold of all dog, too. Everywhere you do. Yeah, but do better be good. Jesse just like. <laughs> yeah. With somebody who needs you. Jesse and the Rippers? <laughs> Jesse and the fucking dripper off the back. <laughs> What a setup at that house, too, dude. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> dude, what did he do for a living? What did Danny Tanner do? Yeah. No one knows. He just fucking afforded this, like, $3 million house in San Francisco and just kept his... Nope. I know what he was. It... No, he was not. Oh, he was, he was on the He was a television news. host. Yeah, he was on the... He... God, it... I was gonna fucking <laughs> nail it. It was him and Becky Katsopoulos. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. But Shit. I don't think he... I don't know. Maybe back then you got paid a shit ton for that. You probably did. Back when then. that house wasn't three mil back then. No, and but but dude, it still was San Fran. A big house. That's a big fucking house, dude. Jesse and the Rippers <laughs> <laughs> in the goddamn like downstairs, the basement. Yeah, dude. yeah, dude. Just killing it with the yeah with, with those shreds, dude. With the goddamn um, <laughs> with the Beach Boys <laughs> and Dave Coulier, just fucking the. <laughs> the, the oddball brother who just, you know, did goofy cartoon shit. It's like, <laughs> it's wow. just like, I've got everyone here. <laughs> like, <laughs> God, dude. Yeah. That's kind of how, it's kind of we have like the most fucked up version of the Full House over did here. Did you watch Full House? Yes. Did you watch Fuller House? No. No. I couldn't do it. No? No, I couldn't. I you wanted, wanted to just leave where it... Yeah, I just wanted it to be yeah, there. It wasn't good. What's Michelle I only, doing? 
Was she even in it? No. Or maybe she was. I don't even know. You watched I, I've them? watched some of them. Too many edibles. Maybe. Yeah, that seems like an edible kind of <laughs> evening. Yeah, yeah. Pop a couple of fucking, you know, yeah. Flintstone vitamins. Yeah. And then, dude, just fuller house. My credibles are a little <laughs> edible. Yeah, <dude. laughs> They're edible credibles. Those are edible credibles. Oof. Damn, dude. But anyway, yeah, shout out to Bob Saggy. Shout out to Bob Sagile. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, I did want to tell you this. And then we'll go. We'll head on over to Cam's corner. Ooh, I'm excited for that. Yeah, it'll be fun. Love that. Yeah, it'll be fun. Okay, so I am uh, patrolling, uh, petroleum in a property, right? And I am surveying territories. Uh, Are we talking about for work or for like a place to live? <laughs> nah, for work. Okay, I'm patrolling, <laughs> put, I'm petroleuming. Sur- I'm surveying territories. Territories. And um, I turn the corner, and this last little, like, unit is a doctor's office. But it's, like, just, like, for, like, uh, I think chiropractic or, like, dental or something or whatever. And <clears throat> I look over, and there this guy, he's in, this old man, he's in mid-fall. Oh, no. Okay? And he he's 90. Okay, and so he's got his haggis, his baggis with him, and he's falling over, dude, bro. He goes, boom, hits his head on the on fucking the, asphalt on the not uh, the sidewalk. Sidewalk. Ugh. And luckily there was like people around, right? And I and so I, I gotta I gotta make sure I see what's going on. You know what I mean? So I like I'm like looking around, kind of like surveying territory. Uh, surveying their story, you know, but also like going as slow Herb as Herb is falling. So Herb, Herb's down. Damn it. Dude. Okay. So I slowly start walking because I got to do my job, dude. I got to walk right there. I got to walk right there. What are you going to, what are you going to do? Dude? I got to walk right by there. And there's like four or five people like kind of like, are you okay, Herb? Are you okay? And he's just like, uh, like looking wild, dude. Yeah. Gushing oh, Jesus. blood out of the out of that the top of cranium, it. and there was a puddle of blood underneath his head, and it looked like mucus. It didn't look. It, I don't know if this is the way blood always looks. I have never had so much blood. Well, that's not true. Usually, if blood's coming out, it's thin because you've always been drinking. But like, <laughs> I don't think I've had full solidity. Yeah, salinity. No, that's that's salt. Um, yeah, viscosity. There it is. I haven't been full viscosed <laughs> ever. You haven't. I think right now you I. You haven't lived, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this was coming out in what seemed to be like snot bubbles yeah. of blood. Oh wow! And he was looking directly into my eye as I'm like walking by, and he's like, Arr! like that, and I was like. Arr! Because at that point, I was like, I shouldn't have come over this way. Like, Because sh- now you got to help. Well, no. I just, now I have to see that face for the for the end of times. You like, did. no, I didn't have to help. There was several people there helping out. <laughs> right? He went down. I caught it. But I was kind of like at a distance where like there's nothing I can do. There was an old lady who fell like a couple months ago. I did help her because there was like nobody else there. And yeah. she, th- there was a whole fucking story. I won't even go into it. But like this guy, I could see him from a distance. He hit the deck and I was like, oh God. Um, and then like the people right inside the door had, had saw it happen. Yeah. So they came right out and there was yeah. like five or six. Yeah. And so they were like holding his head like this. And he was like, Urgh! like doing that. And it was just snot bubbles of fucking shit of, blood just blood coming out coming out and i was like blood. and i and then i was just like well i'm gonna keep walking and i just kept walking oh, finished up the old report and he died you found out i have no clue but probably <sighs> what do you do in that situation nothing right nothing. <sighs> yeah i probably would have jumped in there nah dude you don't think so Six, I think I would have. There were six paramedi. Oh, paramedics? I don't know. They were in scrubs. Paramedics were on the way. Yeah, but an eye doctor can only do so much. Yeah, but what are you going to do? I don't know. 
like lift a leg? I would. God, you would have? Yeah, for sure. Fuck. Well, I feel like it was the last. So time. have you seen videos of when snake venom touches blood? No. And it turns into this gelatinous goo? Have you ever you've never seen this? No. Oh yeah, look up video, dude. You can see what happens to your blood when snake venom hits it. Oh, it turns really? into gelatin. Wow. Yeah, it starts to get all thick and loogy. Loogy. Kind of, that's the first thing I thought of when you said it, it so was like a mucus snot bubble. So a snake bit his head. Right before he hit the ground. He landed. <laughs> a little snake just went, just jumped out, got his ass. Fucking mantis shrink. <laughs> no God him damn over. the fucking dry land mantis <laughs> shrink. <laughs> you haven't seen one of those yet? Dude, it just came out of they a little hole. They have legs. <laughs> yeah. They have legs that just go bop. <laughs> <laughs> if that's not an adult swim cartoon, fuck. Oh, dude. man, yeah. dude. Yeah. Oh, full we'll sell circle. That. We'll sell that to them. Good God. That's heavy, though, because yeah, I, I remember when I was young seeing the first like the first time I saw just a stranger fall down in a store because they were having a seizure or something. Yeah. That's heavy. It is. But and dude, I just want you to know that like what I did say, like I did help a lady. You're like, I hope you get better. <laughs> I just there was many people around. Yeah. And I was like, OK, they got. Yeah. This. If there was a lot of people around scrubs but he, and they were helping him. The thing that sucked, though, is that he was facing the way that I was walking. He was staring at you in the eyes. He going, was just going, Ugh. Ugh. And I was like, at that point, I was like, and you say 90. 90. So he's old. Old, dude. Yeah. He, Damn, he, dude. he must. have. It's like straight up. You're too old to just be walking around, dude. You need to just get wheeled from place to place and just like, dude, just know your fucking limitations. Do you think that when you get to that age, when your kids take your car keys from you, you're you're going to give in so fast? Uh, I, I think he was about 20 years past that. Well, so it's like, I don't know. I've seen when when the weight of your bones is too much for your feet. <laughs> Like, just give it a yeah, rest. He yeah. was one of those guys you could tell was just like every struggle. Every, every step, step was a struggle. You're just like, God damn it. I fucking made it. I'm yeah. fucking doing it. Yeah. yeah. And, just like, and then one little fucking dude, singular path. deviation in the <laughs> fucking concrete. Just just clipped it. Just yeah, clipped a pen. It. Dude. And he just went, ha, ha. <laughs> Oh, man. Dude. And then just. That's so hard. And the, 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 inability to even brace yourself so when you do you're fall, gonna crumble it's just a tree log in the fucking forest so yeah. your head's gonna hit your shoulder's gonna hit this is where like they say that like hips kill old people because they like their whole yeah. hip explodes yeah and then it's like infection and mm. then you're just dead because you're like you your body can't you can't yeah. fight it off you know what i mean yep. so the guy died it's fine you think so mantis shrimp you're probably you're 99 percent sure i think that if he didn't die that's his last outing yeah like that's got to be his last outing like Gladys is like, listen, Herb, guys, stay home. That was the end of that. Yeah. And if you're gonna come out, we're I'll gonna, go get the fucking vitamins. Yeah, and we'll just crane you if you need to go anywhere. We'll just like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just Indian style. <laughs> <laughs> On like a little like craze. He's like, <laughs> he's like Gladys, why are you gonna put me Indian style, you bitch? <laughs> it's gonna take me forever to get out of this. You know, sore. <laughs> but, but if it's his legs hanging down, his like arms hanging down, how sad that would look! Oh, yeah, yeah, just dude, so like in the sandlot where they put him down into the fucking beast backyard, <laughs> just like that, where everything's Close hanging. Close catapult. <laughs> yeah, dude. All right, you want to do camps car? Yeah, I can't wait. Um, we actually have headphones there and headphones there, and we actually have oh, a sweet. microphone, oh, and you, I got a seat set up for you. I'm excited. I love camps. Corner. Yeah, camps. Okay, I gotta unmute these, mute those. We can even sign off from here if you want. Cool.
All right. Okay. Here we go. Can I sit here on the stool? That's where I put you. Okay. That's what you stepped in. That's what you stepped in. There you go. Oh, yeah. Dude, we got to fucking do it. These eyes (laughs) cry every night. Okay, we got, we have 12 videos. Oh, boy. They're quick. We got some. They're quick. We should have brought the fucking bottle over here, son. Bring it. Go get it. Yeah, go get that, Sean. I'm going in the room. Wow, this light is bright. You got the Dude, you bright got... light. <laughs> <laughs> and you <laughs> got <laughs> that motherfucking bright light. You couldn't explain it. Hey, horrid, yeah. Horry had to play it. Herbie had to trip. A mantis shrimp had dipped. (laughs) Okay, so uh, we have 12 um, little things for you, and you can see all the cancer in my face. You know what I'm saying? No. Yeah, look at all the cancer. And, dude, you can definitely see this, which is... What, your eyes? No, the... um, Oh, the sty. The sty that I've got one of those. It turned into a... um, Cyst. Yeah. I've got one, too. You got to get it removed? Probably. Yeah. I probably should. It's not on my... It's not on the forefront of my uh, twiggle thingy. Twiggle thingy. <sighs> okay, how do I do this? Is this in Bali, <laughs> dude? You're gonna like this one, bro. You ready? Okay, here you go. Oh, what? <laughs> dude, I'm dope. That's legit. <laughs> Whoa! Did you see his little? Thing? Yeah, a little. <laughs> yep. <laughs> this guy's rad. Look. Oh, oh, dude, That's feeling it. Bananas, dude. You know who would be so good at that? Who? You. I, I would be all right at that. You would, because huh? you're like skimboard guy. Oh, shit. Wrong camera. Like, I would uh, watch you skimboard, and I'd be like, oh, that's a oh, yeah. broken fucking neck if I do it. You know what I was thinking about? That's bo- That's fucking cool. You dude. know what I was thinking about when I saw that? I go, that is everything I wish Slide Rock was in, <laughs> in Flagstaff. Yeah, yeah, dude. Except for... It's not. It's not even. You stub your fucking toe and you get a sty that turned into a cyst. It's a little fat Hispanic kid just sort of slowly rolling down. Yeah, and you can't go any faster. No. You're waiting. Uh, Yeah. Yeah, it's. Is that you? Nah. Really? I try to avoid as many alarms as possible. Who the f- I have, my phone has never done that before, but I see my phone lit up. That's interesting. Mm. Okay. That was rad. I would fall. <laughs> what is it? Four and three. Okay. Wow. Okay. Sorry. Uh, number two. Nice. Tell me Good old family th- gathering with some kugel. We'll see what you think about this. Jesus. <laughs> you want to see it again? Yeah. <laughs> nice, nice. Dude, that, that's yeah, pretty he good. tosses that thing. <laughs> Dude, I love how he goes off on his own. He, <laughs> he's like trying to make him puke. Too. <laughs> 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 When he looks the other direction and does it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he's on his own. Yeah, dude, it's like. Dude, that guy, the thing I love about that, <laughs> he's old and he's like, dude, yeah, I'll I, do whatever I want to do. Yeah. I'll make whatever expressions. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> All right. And if this kid pukes, great. Fucking great. I don't have to clean it up. <laughs> Leave. Uh, I wonder what his inner monologue was. <laughs> Do you feel? <laughs> <me>? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, and this one's, I don't know. Oh, shit. <laughs> that a boy. Is that a ham? Oh, oh it's a. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, dude. So <laughs> that like went down into a parking garage maybe and hit a car for sure. <laughs> okay, so let's listen to it. Let's listen to it. That's exactly what happened. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh shit. Two liter of Coke. Oh, 
two stories shit. down. Oh shit! <laughs> no, it's Not like. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's like, oh. dude, you know the impact of that fucker? Oh, so bad. <laughs> yeah, dude. That's two stories of it getting shaken up. <laughs> yeah, dude. It must have hit <coughs> must it, have hit on the seal, like on the thing, right? And it probably shot. It just fucking shot, yeah. <laughs> the guy's like, oh. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. It's like, why are they doing that? <laughs> I know. <laughs> Go down there. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'll get a two liter. I I would have been out with on the two liter part. You know what? Mm-hmm. That's no. That's actually worse than throwing a cup full of soda with the lid on out. Or is it not? It's way worse. Because you're damaging vehicles now. Yeah, and property. The, and then the spray. Yeah. Just the spray. And the bystander cars that got sprayed. I can't believe it's not butter. <laughs> Spray. Spray. <laughs> what is that? Dude, you don't remember that commercial? No. <laughs> oh is it Fabio? <laughs> yes. Okay, I do. <laughs> so it's like, you know, he does the I can't believe it's not butter. Yeah. But then they put it in spray form. And he goes, spray. And he goes, I can't believe it's not butter. <laughs> spray. <laughs> I swear to God, dude. I remember just being like, ew! <laughs> I know, dude. Fabio, you're already weird and gross. Dude, just Fabio spray. sex butter commercial, dude. Spray on my cock. <laughs> I spray it on my cock. And fuck all the porkers around here. All right? Yes. Next video for you, Cameron. And here you go, buddy. The voles. <laughs> Dude, played off so well. He couldn't have done a better job of playing that off. I mean, dude, he he fucking hit that hard for sure. But he he did a damn good job, I think. I love those eyes. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. Here, let's watch it one more time. (laughs) Dude, the classic fucking. Oh, should I feel for blood or whatever? <laughs> like he just played it off. He's like, I'm all right. He did pretty good. Yeah. Who are the voles? Who are the voles? Yeah. Um, owl pellet poops. What Vol- state? What what city? You remember doing the voles in uh, HPA? He was wearing a voles sports shirt, like um, they were a basketball team. No. Yeah, I remember the voles. Okay, so that was the voles. Bones. Bones. It was like a big hairy pellet. Yeah. Oh, this one. You know what? This one. This one suits you well. I think I've seen you do something <laughs> like this before. Oh, really? Yeah. I already know what's going to happen. Well, you know, it's tradition to always throw back like the first catch. So I'm just going to let him go home with his family. Be free. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, bro. <laughs> how did, how did you do It's so <laughs> fucking hard. <laughs> yeah. I, here, let's watch him over that. Dude. Let's watch him over that. Here we go. Here's Cameron. Here we go. 15 well, years ago, this is champ. It's tradition to always throw back like the first catch, so I'm just going to let him go home with his family. Be free! God, so damn, loud. Dude. Yeah. Dude, and you know, maybe that thing didn't feel it. Nah. Maybe dude. he's like, what the fuck was that? And then just swam away? Do you, you think about like what fish think? Yes. When they've been pulled out. This is what I'm saying. Yeah. They're like, ah! you know, I, well, think, I think we, we would kind of go. Yeah, you we would hurl the distance. them. Yeah, we would hurl them because it's like if you're gonna be out of water, let's give you the full experience. <laughs> dude, some of our wind ups, <laughs> yeah, dude, we're tossing them back in. We'd be like, shot put, we, yeah, we'd be like <laughs> Olympic, yeah, yeah, dude. All right, buddy, immature. You're, you're gonna like this, bud. I'll tell you this right now. Okay. Fuck! <laughs> Dude, he's like fucking six feet in the air at least. Dude. Timing, timing on that, bro. So here's the whole like the thing about this is like it must be Tony Hawk's pro uh, pro skater when like you're when you're uh, 
when your controller disconnects, that's what happens to your player. <laughs> oh, I get it now. So there's like this whole thing, but still, that is the most hilarious looking thing Fuck. ever. Yeah. <laughs> it's B-Man. <laughs> Dude. Oh my God. Where does he land? I know. It's like the bowling chick and the Lebowski. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Where do you land? Floating. Hmm. I've saved some really good ones. These these have been good so far, aren't they? Yeah, they are. Um, I don't. Remember, you never disappoint. I don't remember this one. Okay, you ready? Oh yes, I do. <laughs> God damn it! It's like. <laughs> I showed you the one like, of the cereal, the little guy that goes in the cereal. Same kind of thing. And is it one of those like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. This, this one's better though for some reason. <laughs> and dude, that's the amazing thing about like all of this. You just find a video. I wonder what that person really did. It looked, he looked like he was part of like the cheer squad. Yeah. You know what I mean? And the crazy thing is like you don't see a lot of... And they of... tossed that motherfucker. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Dude, he did six flips. Cedric's in the ceiling <laughs> fan again. <Cedric. laughs> He's swinging around from his dreadlock. <laughs> uh, you don't see a lot of black little people. No, you, know you don't. I mean? Now that you mention that, it's not like I. Do, it does not seem like a very super common thing. So when you see one, you want a video like you gotta, that. You got to. You got to. Yeah, Dude, you, you got to do, do the fishbowl. Got to do the fishbowl. Got to shout them out. We got a fish. This one's kind of fun. Oh, okay. So what the f shit? What was his name? Ryan. Hey, Ryan. Um, I think I'm on the right one. Ryan sent in. He he. Uh, he'll he'll message me on our Instagram, and. He's um, I don't know if he watches or listens all the time, but he's definitely like active with me on like through the Instagram page. His name's Ryan. Anyways, um, he sent me two videos. Like for he he he'll send me he sent me several videos, just like like reels. He'll just like forward them to me, and they're always hilarious. But these ones he sent to me in the last like couple days. I was like, I'm gonna put it on Cam's corner, and so this was one of them. And this one I was like, oh my goodness. Come on, what are we doing in this world? Faith reads her copy in Braille. She's quick with a joke. Is there anything you can't do, Faith? See? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Good for her. 11-year-old radio host inspires America with her visions of hope. And this is what the... What a dick. Dude, the fucking host. God, is there anything you can't do? Faith reads her copy in Braille. She's quick with a joke. Is there anything you can't do, Faith? See? <laughs> that's, that's actually the best joke yep. of all time. Yep. Dude, she absolutely fucking owned. Yeah. Uh, see, I wanted... She to asked for that. Like, I mean, come on. Is there anything you can't is do? Is there anything you can't do? Yeah. How did you get this job, you fucking... <laughs> know what orange is? <laughs> I know, right? Like, what? Yeah. <laughs> Is there anything? You, um, no. Explain the Niagara Falls. <laughs> uh, like, dude. But the what fact a that, dickhead. The fact that she just goes, see? <laughs> yeah, dude. Owned. Owned. She, she really. God, if there was a fucking land mantis, <laughs> that reporter needed to get fucking. Land mantis. <laughs> she needed to get land mantis. Is that the name of the episode? <laughs> yeah, for land sure. Land mantis. Done. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. You're going to love this, Cam. Watch, fool. I'm going to come over there and fuck your ass up, fool. Come in my yard. I'll call cops. You think I'm scared of the fucking police, fool? <laughs> okay. I was like, oh, this is not that funny, but. Fucking motherfucker. Right here. Watch, fool. <laughs> this is, this is yes, dude. <laughs> Looking like a cracked out Zach De La Rocha. He has. Yes. Doesn't he look like Zach De La Rocha? Let's see. I love. No. Who does he look like? 
Who does he look like? Mm. I don't know. Somebody I don't think I would want to fuck with, dude. No. That's the guy. Even though he's kind of the bitch. He's definitely. <laughs> so. Once he goes in and locks his door. <laughs> and then just does that. <laughs> if he's fuck trying me. to be funny, he wins. <laughs> you know? All right. I, I, I don't think he was trying. I think he was actually fearful. Okay, this one, honestly, you know, I think I'm going to. No, I'm going to play it right now. This one kind of reminds me of me and you. And <laughs> In a little bit of a way. That dude looks like little Cam, kind of. Here we go. I feel like this is me. And this is you. Okay? Here we go. That's that ice cream. You get home after a drunk night, you get ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> dude, that's mushrooms. <laughs> Dude, for sure. <laughs> That's why so many. Yeah. That's why so many. That's you get that ice cream. You know you that's three a.m. Night. Would you get home after that? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh my god, dude. I was not expecting that. <laughs> dude, we, I think we've had some nights like that. <laughs> Definitely. Where we just sat at the fucking counter. Oh yeah. You know, at three a.m. Just like <laughs> using every last morsel of fucking laughter that we have. The thing is, is when you catch your buddy off guard <laughs> yeah. with like an extra little little pizzazz. It's the best. It's the best. It's the good stuff. Yeah. Um, I actually went through that guy's profile, and he's just a fucking wild. He, I don't. He's not on shrooms. He's just like he knows what he's doing. Yeah. This is an entertainment. It's good. Yeah. And he fucking he really is hilarious. Good dude um, to hang out with and go drinking with one night. You know, I'm gonna play this one. So this is called karaoke with black guys, and these white boys. Pick the song that has the n-word in it a lot so oh they, great so they um i've always wanted to see how this would go over this is how it would go over brilliant <laughs> that's brilliant <laughs> right yes that's what you should do that's what you should do you go, hey, uh, Phil. Yeah, um, because, yeah, look at Finn and Quinn. Fucking, I don't know. Who's Finn? Oh, Finn and Quinn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they they are not allowed to no, say they anything. they are not. No. But if they did, they would get a pass. You know what I mean? They just have their boy, Phil. He did it. Yeah. And this is the last one, and then we'll go home. Oh, and this, this one... I'll I, I tell you what, man. This one, I was like, should I? And then I was like, you know what? If anyone will think this is funny with me, it's my boy, Cam. Oh, wow. Coconut. Yeah, fucking. He had no idea that <laughs> they were filming him, <laughs> dude. Like, he, wow. And he's dead ass. Wow, yeah, coconut. Dude. Wow. <laughs> Let's watch that one more time. There's something good about that. So, yeah, it is good because it, he genuinely got caught being genuine. Yes. <laughs> yeah. This big tough guy. Oh, yeah. Wow. wow, coconut. Coconut. <laughs> dude, hold on. Reverse real quick. <laughs> that fucking top lip, dude. Right. Right here. <laughs> dude, the little twitch dude, is amazing, dude. That's the look of amazing, like, of amazed. Like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Dude, those eyes. Yeah, dude. You tell me there's not a more genuine view of it. Yeah, dude. All right, let's watch this fool one more time. Oh, wow. Coconut. 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 Coconut.
<laughs> but I love how the guy in the background's like, no, it's vanilla. And he goes, no, he goes, coconut. <laughs> yeah, it's vanilla. It's like banana, not coconut. Coconut, wow. And then he just licks the inside <laughs> out. <laughs> that was a good Cam's Corner. That was fun. That was good. And that's the, uh, that concludes this episode of the goddamn show. Thank you. Thank you. No, but seriously, dude. Bye. I love you, dude. It's good to see you. It's good to see you again. Fuck. Can't believe it's been so goddamn long since we've done this. And we next we d- week. We will see you guys next week and every week, like we usually do. We ain't gonna fuck around on you no more. We're gonna bring you some cool dude. We got some I got some we got we got some guests that are gonna be super fun. Yeah. I'm, I'm very excited. And you guys, uh, I don't know when they're coming on, but we definitely have some really fun, unique. We've got them in the shoot. We got them in the shoot. We got two dudes in the shoot. We got them in the shoot tubes. The dude shoot? The dude shoots. Oh, oh fuck. Wonderful. All right. We got. We will see you guys next week. Uh, I love you, brother. Thank <laughs> you. Uh, like, share. Thank you. Bum, bum, bum. Thank you. Thank you. Bum, bum, bum. Thank you. Can't believe you stuck it out. We can't believe you had no doubt.